Hello everyone, we're back with another starring video. We have some stray kids today, not a lot, but you know, we're getting somewhere with the collection. Uh, we have some Gut7, as always, we have some EXO, and we have a lot of winner right here. Um, yeah, let's get right into it. This time we will start with Stray Kids. Here's my Stray Kids binder. Um, I'm using the Dragon Shield Clear Classic sleeves as always. So yeah, let's get started with this one. And that was the package that just fell over. <laughs> um, which album is the first one? Okay, the first one is Mixed Up. I think I already sorted them in the right order, but yeah, let's see. <laughs> So the first card that we have is for mixtape and that's the Spangchan card. Um, yeah, it has a scratch on it, but a lot of Stray Kids cards have that, so yeah. And whose fault is it? It's JYP's fault, woo! Okay, um, yeah, <laughs> but I'm really happy that I finally got some cards for this collection because we didn't have the Spiner out for a while, I think, so... And of course I had it not in the right direction, order, not direction, order. Why am I always getting so confused with the cards? Those three car uh, those three albums are always weird to me. Okay, so we have the Felix card for the selfie version. Okay, ooh, this page looks good. Yep, I like this page. Only uh, Chisang missing and Chang missing. Okay. Good progress, and I actually have one of the unit cards on the way. And I think I will change this page into an eight pocket page, but we will do that another time. I don't know why I didn't do that before, but yeah. Okay, we have another Felix card for the I Am Who album for the making version. There we go. AT's new album will come out in like two weeks, I think. Um, and you know me by now, I have too much albums on the way, but mm, this time I was a little bit, yay, we have a card for this page. It's not empty anymore. Um, I have a lot of albums on the way, but <laughs> I um, decided to do my group order this time a little bit different because uh, we ordered from Apple Music and we decided to do like, um, what did we decide to do? I can't talk and think at the same time again. We have a Yanjin card for the black border for Yellowwood, not Yellowwood Mirror, I mean. <laughs> um, yeah, to do like a Apple Music option only and because I'm not really collecting uh, special cards for 80s, I will keep some of them because, you know, I have them then, but <laughs> um, yeah. So I have a lot of albums on the way, but I did not pay the whole price for them because the people already bought the Apple Music card from me, if that makes sense. We have this Yanjin yellow border from Yellowwood. <laughs> um, so yeah, I have a lot of 80s albums on the way. What I'm trying to say with this is um, I have a lot of limited cards that I don't really need. <laughs> um, so I'm hoping that I can trade them off to some of Stray Kids cards because I really would like to make a progress in this collection. So yeah, that would be cool. Um, we have Jisung's selfie from the indoor version. Or is this even a selfie? Who knows by now? So yeah, I'm hoping that I can trade a lot of cards to Stray Kids cards. So I can make a little progress in this collection. And we have one more card for Yellowwood. It's Chan's outdoor version. Okay, this page is also looking pretty good. Only this row is missing, but that's fine. <laughs> and we have one more card, but I think it's for Levant, right? Yeah, it's this Yanjin card. And it is for which page? For this one. Okay. 
it was a little progress in my collection, but we made some progress, so that's always good. And we actually have something more going all the way back to in life because I don't even know why, but I never put in the postcards. <laughs> why did I never put them in? I mean, you probably know because maybe you watched my planning, so maybe you know it. Maybe you know it better than me, so were those pre-order? I don't think so. But this one was pre-order. What was pre-order for in life? I can't remember. Um, but yeah, all of the PCs are actually on the way, which is really exciting. So this album will be done. But I think I would just gonna put those right here. Just grab the two pocket sleeve from Ultra Pro. So we can put them right in here. Does it matter how we put them in? Mm, let's put this one in on top because it has Bang Chan on it and he's the oldest. Just why not? <laughs> and the second one. There we go. Okay, um, that was it for Stray Kids. I'm really happy that I had the spider out for now. Um, yeah, I hadn't I didn't have it out for a while, so yep, yeah, I'm really happy about this. Um, let's grab the EXO binder next. I think we only have EXO cards. We don't have any unit cards, I think. Or is this one? Nope, it's not. Um, yeah, I will sort them real quick and then I will be back. Okay, let's start with the first page. I don't know why I showed you all the PCs, like, really random on some kind of page. Um, do we have anything for Mama? No, we don't have anything. <laughs> Still looking sad, but it's fine. But we have something for XOXO, my first card, yay! We have Kai's card, um, and I think I was just gonna put them in like this. I think that there are some people who say this is the right side. Those would look cool in an 8 pocket, but since there are 9 cards on this page, I'm not gonna put them into, a nine po uh, into an 8 pocket, but yeah, I was just gonna put them in like this. <laughs> I mean, the pictures are basically the same. So yeah, that was it for XOXO, and we actually have a few cards for Crow. We have all of these cards. Um, okay, we have Lei, we have Baekhyun, oh no, that was the wrong one. We don't have this Lei, the, yeah, the Lei goes onto the other page. Whoops, okay, we have Baekhyun and we have Chanyeol, okay. One of the coolest Chanyeol PCs ever. <laughs> but let's get started with the Spekyan one. I think we had a discussion with Ines on a Neo Q haul <laughs> about the EXO cards. So I will tell you what, I, what we think now is correct. So all the Korean presses have the specs on it. Those two are Chinese presses because they don't have the specs on them because they're flimsier than the other one. Am I correct or am I wrong? <laughs> Please tell me if I'm right or if I'm wrong. Okay, we actually have two cards for this page, which is pretty cool. So finally getting some EXO cards in here. For this page we have Lei and Baekhyun. And this one is then Korean press because it has the specs on it or is this only for Mama? I'm still confused with the cards. Can you tell me if there's like a good video about EXO cards where someone explains it? <laughs> I know that there is a video about fake EXO cards and real EXO cards from um, Katie, but I don't know if she has like a Chinese and Korean press video. If she has one, please let me know because I really would like to watch it. <laughs> um, we have this Chan Yeo card from Overdose, but I think, <sighs> I searched up on her channel and I couldn't find one, so I don't know if she has one or not. But if you know anyone <laughs> who can explain it to me, please let me know. Okay, we have Tanya for this page, so this page is looking better than before as well. Next we have Exodus and we do have quite a lot of cards for Exodus, which is pretty cool. We have Lei for the Korean version, we have Baekhyun for the Korean version and we have Tanya for the Korean version. So that is pretty cool. The Korean version has the white back and the Chinese version has the, uh, what did I just say, black back. 
I do know that. But only because my template said so, so thank you, template maker. <laughs> Which hands are these? <laughs> and there are some random knees in the background. Nice back here. And we have a really blonde lady. <laughs> Ah, okay, this this video is a good one. EXO makes me really happy because we have a lot of EXO cards. We finally had the Stray Kids banner out again. And we will have a lot of winner cards later on. I mean, I just put in some winner cards in my last one, but it's always good to put in winner cards. And for this page, we also have three cards. We have Sehun, we have Kai, and we have Lei again, so... Exodus is actually done for Lei. <laughs> Lei with a hoodie and not blonde anymore suddenly. And Sehun. Okay, there we go. This page suddenly looks a lot better than before. I'm really happy about this. Okay, next we have Love Me Right, do we have one? Oh yeah, we actually do. We have the sleigh, it's also for the Korean version. I had this card once when I started my collection journey because I thought I would only collect Lei and then I found out. I mean, I bought his cards because I, uh, before I really was into K-pop. <laughs> I just found that card and I didn't even knew that collecting was a thing. But I had this card, I bought it because I thought it was so cute, so I bought it, but then I didn't, I decided to not collect EXO, and then I reselled it, and now I needed to buy it again, but never mind. <laughs> we have some cards for Sing For You. We have those two, and both of these go onto this page, because for Sing For You, I'm only collecting um, one card for each member. So we have one Chanyo and one Kyangsu. Collecting Kyangsu is really difficult. Not because his cards are hard to find. I mean, kind of EXO in general is harder to find than my other groups and Stray Kids. Those two groups are actually the two groups that are the hardest for me to collect. But because Kyangsu is doing that pose on every single PC, <laughs> it's so hard to know if you already have the card or not. I always have my template next to me when I'm searching for... Um, those cards so yeah <laughs> we have exact and I which cards are there okay so two of those go onto this page um and this one and Kai I think is it this one probably <laughs> it doesn't even matter because both of them look so similar And this card, I don't know why. I mean, he looks really cool because of his wound and everything. But this one is one of the cutest Kai cards that are out there. I really love this one. And Tanya with his red hair. I really like red hair. <laughs> there we go. Okay, and this Tanya goes on to this page. So, <laughs> Chan finally has a friend on this page. There we go. Okay, next album. And uh, do we have anything for Lotto? No, we don't have anything for here. Do we have anything for live? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. But we do have something for Coco Bob. Yay, uh, for the war. Um, we have one card. And this one goes onto this page. So finally another card for this collection. And finally a card on this page. Hopefully Schumann has some friends. <laughs> Soon, pretty soon, I hope so. There we go. Okay, um, <laughs> I messed up. We have some cards for For Life. Those are not from Universe, those are from uh, For Life. Um, this one is a Chinese press one, and this one is Korean press, but since they look. No, wait. I'm confused again. I will maybe put it on the screen, but I decided for for life. No, this is Chinese press because those symbols are Chinese, and this is Korean. Um, but I think I decided to only collect one of those 
for each member and it didn't really matter to me which one. That's the reason why I have another template than I have the card for. Um, because there were two cards that I did not want to collect for this collection, so I decided to only collect one card for each member. But now I'm confused again because of the presses. Is one version Chinese press and one Korean, or did I just have two different... Or is this card available in Chinese press and Korean press? I'm confused. Okay, um, <laughs> next moment, actually the last one, is Don't Mess Up My Tempo. Right here, and we actually have quite a few cards for this collection, which is pretty cool. First of all, we have Chanyo from the Allegro version. I mean, he uses he used basically an animal filter for all of his cards, so... <laughs> really cute. Okay, next we have the Mororato version, and we have a Chanyo for this one again. Next is the Andante version, and we actually have two cards for this page. We have Chan and Chanyo. Really sleepy looking Chanyo. And for the Vivace version, we have a Chan, so finally a card on this page as well. Okay, this is pretty exciting. The feeling was really good putting in those cards. Okay, um, that was it for the EXO binder actually. Um, next, let's grab the winner one. For winner we have all of these bigger inclusions and all of these photo cards, so I will sort them real quick and then we can put them in. The first album that we have some cards for is Exit E. And we have two Taeyang cards and one Mino cards. And both of these go into the um, Alexandra Palace version, I think. No. Whoops. <laughs> into the shortage version. Did I do I have one filler wrong in here? Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, M, 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 M. There we go. Oh, wow, we're completing this page. Yes. Okay, so we have this Mino card and both of Tan's cards. So this is really cool. First one goes in. And the second Tan card. Yay. I'm only missing two more Tan cards for Exit E. That is good. And we have this Mino card. Am I actually done with Mino's cards? Do I have him for the Westminster version? No, but I don't. <laughs> okay, never mind. I thought I had him complete for this album. Oh well. We have one Chino card for the Fate number no. 4 album for the. Who? This is the LA version, this is the Soul version, I think. And we're actually completing this page with some Yoon's LA version, maybe. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Ooh, I like these pages. Okay, next we have R24, and we actually have quite a lot for R24. Um, I think we're completing the lenticulars today. Okay, first of all, we need a Huni lenticular. And we have it right here. So we can put this one in. Okay, page is done. And actually the first version is also done. Second version, oh no, we're not completing it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but we do have the Krug one. Why did I print out this filler that big? <laughs> okay, never mind. We have the Krug one. We have use. 
So Chinus is still missing, but it is on the way. I actually completed those and we have Minos lenticular. So only the last Chinu one needs to arrive and then we're done with the lenticulars. Yay, okay. Um, and these are the two photo cards for Uni <laughs> that we need to put in. First one where he's riding something, it looks like a golf car or something. And the second one from the dream version and the other one is called the youth version, I think. Wait, isn't it written on the template somewhere? I mean, it was written on this one. <laughs> That's the only reason why I knew it. Nope, it's not written anywhere. Why is this filler so crooked? But I think it was written on the other one. I think this is the youth version. Wait, let me look for it. Oh, there it is. Yep, yeah, that was the youth version. Youth and dream. <laughs> okay, moving on to every day. Those are the normal album inclusions. And we do have quite a few cards for every day. Um, this is the day version. So let's see if we have any cards for this page. What kind of... Templates. <laughs> I guess it's this card because the other black and white one is already in, I think. Oh wow, me and my templates. Uh, where is it? Oh, okay, yeah, the other black and white one is black and white one is already in. So <laughs> I'm suppose I suppose this one is the right one. But first, let's put in Mino, and then we can put in this black and white Huni card and we're completing this page yes okay this is really cool are, are we completing this complete album would be cool let's see we have Yoon and we have Huni which means another completed page And Yoon with his blue gloves that I realized only once I had the card in my hands, but uh, yeah. Next, oh no, I'm missing one. I don't have this um, Chinu card. Oh, that is sad. I, I, right, this is the last card that I'm missing for every day. Oh, that is sad. <laughs> I was totally in the mood for completing this whole album. Oh well. But we have this Huni card. And we have this really cute crew card. There we go. So this page is almost complete. <laughs> this page was already completed as well as this one. And we're completing... Oh, wait. Uh huh? Is this card still in the Neoki warehouse? Because I did buy this one. It probably is. <laughs> but okay. Um, but we can put in Yoon's card and the group one for the night version. Oh no, it's the wrong side. <laughs> but since I have gray paper at the back, it doesn't really matter which way I put it in. out and Yoon's card okay so I think this one is still in the warehouse and the other one I need to buy wait do I already have this one <laughs> or did I skip that page oh I do already have this so yep this one will be up for trader sale on my Instagram Okay, and now for the Polaroids, we have quite a few. We have this one, we have this one, and we have this one. Yay, we're completing this page. So the Polaroids for the day version are done. Oh, 
this on the nose powder right. There we go. And let's see for the night version. Yay, we're also completing the night version. So all of the Polaroids for every day are in this binder. Yes, <laughs> that is cool. Okay, for millions, we do actually have two cards, but both of these go onto this page. <laughs> both of these are some Mino cards. First one and the second one. There we go, finally making some progress on millions. And I think that was actually it. Do we have nothing for cross? What happened? We had so many cross cards last time. We don't have anything for cross. Okay, well, um, <laughs> then that was it for the winner section in this video. And the last section for this video will be GUT7. So let me grab that banner real quick. This is my GUT7 Japanese album banner and we didn't have this one out in a while as well. So I'm really happy that we do have it out now. Um, and these are all the cards that we have for today. So let me sort them as well real quick. We actually have some cards for the first album, which is pretty cool. We have JB and Yangji for all around the world. Um, and I thought I finished this set <laughs> with my last Neokyo order, but apparently Yu-Gi-Oh! wasn't in it. Um, so yeah, I'm almost done with this set. I still need Yu-Gi-Oh! for this one, but that's fine. I really need to cut that. <laughs> I'm still debating if I should cut them off or not. I mean, it lo would look so much nicer if I would just cut them off, and I mean... I know that they would lose on value, but it would look a lot nicer in my binder. I mean, look at this Bam Bam. Bam Bam looks totally okay. He's not sticking out or anything. I mean, he's a little bit crooked, but that's okay. <laughs> but he's not sticking out. Hmm. I don't know what to do. And Mark, look at Mark. He looks totally fine in here. <laughs> um, yeah. And I mean, those are already have the hole in it, so. I don't know what to do. Never mind. We have Love Train and we actually have one card for Love Train. We have Mark for this one, so finally <laughs> one card in this row. There we go. Okay. Next we have Love, Love, Love. And we finally have a friend for Jackson. <laughs> Bam Bam will join him on this page. Yep, still no Mario Gattio, <laughs> but that's fine. And nothing for Heya. Do we have something for this page? Yep, we actually do. We have this Yugi Yam. So only Young Jim is missing on this page. Maybe I can find like a good Young Jim. Oh no, Yugi Yam was missing for all around the world. Dang it. <laughs> I was hoping to find a Young Jim set, but nope. We have Turn Up. Uh, we don't have anything for Turn Up, actually. <laughs> Yeah, we still don't have those Tower Records cards, but since I have Bam Bam in here, I was just gonna put in yu gi -Oh! as well. Hmm. Those are different pictures, right? Oh, I do already have this one. Oh, okay, well, this one will be up for trade or sale. Oh, well. Oh right, those were the same cards, same pictures, right? So there are three different versions of the same picture. There are like those holo ones, the Tower Records one and this one. Am I right? I mean, I only need one. And I thought the Tower Records one would be easier to get, but... Let's just put him in to cover the page, the, the empty space, I mean. And the last album that we have stuff for is Love Loop. And I actually have Yu-Gi-Oh! for this page. And this is really cool because Love Loop 
and also sing for you are the two Japanese albums that are the hardest to get so I'm happy about every single card that I have for that album okay that was it for love loop and we have some more Yugi cards for just two um, this one goes onto this page Oh, my box is empty. I need to grab another one real quick. Okay, which one was it? This one, right? Okay, so let's put them in. Maybe I should change the layout so those would go into a nine pocket page, but then they're standing over the edge again, which I don't like. <laughs> um, and also some of the unit ones do go like this, or are they only one, two, three? Five, six. No, those aren't even. Oh, never mind. <sighs> just ignore what I just said. Um, <laughs> now I kind of completely lost track. Okay, we don't have anything for this page. We don't have anything for this one. We don't have anything for this one. But we have one for this page. I think I will need to rearrange this section one time. Hmm. It is kind of my favorite section because I really like the photo cards and I also really like the fillers. But how I am storing them, I don't know if I still like that. Yeah, you are completing this page. That is really cool. So how many cards are we missing for just two? I think six or seven, no seven, I think. So we're missing one JB, one Yugi, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, okay, seven out of 30. That is a good deal, that's okay. <laughs> um, yeah, that was it for Got7 and that was it for the starring video. Let's just go to the nice front cover that I really like. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that was it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this video, thank you so much for watching and maybe we'll see some next one. Bye!